Something as simple like that. Let me go ahead and turn this into audio so I can manipulate it a little bit better, a little bit different. I'm going to clone it. We can go ahead and normalize both of them and put it on stretch, put Effectrix on one of them, reverse that right there. Good, good, good. Now, one thing I did not do and I forgot to do, I should probably do it right now is turn down the sample rate, turn it down to like 3000. All right, cool. Now we got to take that and put that on 27. So it has the effect. Good. Now let's do the same thing with this one. Let's take the sample rate down to 3000. Now, what I want to do is this experiment. Let's keep the reverse one as the main one and let's put halftime on this. On the first one. I like it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to get a little perk loop in here. Let me try some bass really quick in here. I'm not sure if it's going to work, but I'm curious what it would sound like if I threw it in there. Hmm. Kind of like that. My drums on a bus here with some knock. Okay, I want to take this and I want to duplicate this and I want to take that one and I want to see what it would do if I do something like this over here. Get rid of that. And then do the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. You know. I right, do the same thing with this. Let's get some cinematic trailer stuff going on. Okay, now we need like a hit right there. Like a boom. Ten might work. Let's try it out. All right, let me add some vo voices to this and see what we can get here. Some vocals. All right. All right, cool. Now let's go ahead and take this and let's go mix it properly in the mix here with my effects so it sounds the way I like it and there you go let's compress everything a little bit bring it together yeah I think this is pretty chillax this is what people have been asking for something like this now what if I just started off kind of differently like over here and
with that bounce going. <laughs> 